Act up, you could get locked up. Act up, you could get locked up. Period. Greetings, royal family. I'm back with another video. I don't know if you heard, but our girl JT is not getting an early release from jail. JT is the other half of City Girls. So the group consists of JT and Young Miami. Two MCs that joined forces, created a group. They're from Florida, Miami, Florida, from the 305. But last year, honey, JT had some bad luck. Um, she was sentenced to 24 months of jail time for fraud and identity theft. So she is almost completed a year. July of this year will make 12 months of her 24 month stint. So she, you know, motioned for early release and the judge said, no, just said, no. Um, they're actually waiting for the Bureau of Prisons to make a decision. So it's a possibility that she still could be released into a halfway house um, to serve out the remaining first year um, of her term. Um, and then she'll be on probation for a year. So I don't know, y'all. I think, listen, I think that she should do her time. I'm not a hater. I know everybody's like free JT, free JT. But let me tell you something. I was a victim of not identity theft, but credit card theft. So someone stole my credit card information when I was in college. And let me tell you something, that ish was a nightmare. Oh my God. It was a nightmare. Luckily I had a good credit card company. I won't say who, because they're not sponsoring this video period. Okay. And everything, you know, worked out. It took a little bit of time, but I was so, oh, I was so angry and so ticked off. So I had money stolen from me. I had my credit card information taken again when I was away at college. And um, if it wasn't for street justice, um, homegirl that took my information would basically be serving time just like JT. So since you do this crime, you gotta do the time. I'm sorry. Like for, it wasn't worth it. Like, you know, you stole someone's identity. You racked up a thousand dollars in charges. So you're gonna have to eat that sis. I'm not a hater. I'm just saying. Ain't no free JT. Don't free JT. Keep your behind in jail. Sit your behind down. Think about what you did. Basically, you have something to look forward to. Good thing your girl, Young Miami, is holding it down. So you have something to look forward to. So um, the article that I read stated that her lawyer, JT's lawyer, was really pushing for her to get a early release. You know, basically stating to the judge that she has she's the half of a, uh, a rap group and they've accumulated so much fame and you can assure that my client will not commit any more crimes or get into any more trouble yada yada so the judge you know he denied it i mean again there's still a possibility a great chance that she might be released early depending if the bureau of prisons comes up with a decision and presents that decision to the judge but i think that she should at least serve one full year in jail and then, you know, another year of probation. But can you handle it, JT? Like, did you calm down? Are you only calm because you're behind bars? Are you going to act up when you get out of jail? But I'm just saying, I'm not a hater. But as a victim of credit card theft, if it wasn't for street justice, homegirl that stole my information would have probably been in jail too. So... We'll see. I'm going to keep following this story because I'm going to be honest with you. I, I, I'm digging, I'm digging city girls. I'm digging city girls. Their content, I mean, as far as their lyrics are concerned, I mean, I wouldn't want my daughter reciting those lyrics, but I'm just saying, you know what I mean? I like their whole grind, their hustle. Their rag, I love a good rags to riches story. But JT says, you act up, you're going to stay locked up, girl. You got you to gotta do that time. You got to eat that. Period. Oh, until next time, royal family. Peace.